Hey guys, Mitch here, and I'm back at it again with another vlog discussion video. In today's vlog discussion video, it's going to be a bit different subject-wise. When I first started doing these vlog discussion videos, I thought they were just going to be on Pokemon Go and the contents that game has in it and different topics pertaining to that game. But I've noticed something here lately that I want to voice my thoughts and opinions on in this vlog, and that is the ch uh, pardon the train noise in the background. I can't control anything that's going on. I'm out filming as I normally do in a pretty chill location. I'm the only one here in this area. But as I was saying, the topic I want to talk, touch on today is YouTube. YouTube and how they're basically screwing out small content creators from views, likes, comments, subscribers, you name it. And I believe I'm going to pick this up and walk a little. So that's cool with you guys. Because I feel like I want, I want to walk some. Alright. So, last week, YouTube said something else that people didn't like. This was on Twitter. I don't, I don't have a link to it. don't have a video grab of it. And the video, a screen grab of it. But it basically, they, they replied to someone, which I guess is very rare for YouTube, Team YouTube to do. But it basically said that they are going to be changing the way. They're, they're experimenting with something new. I have to really think about what that tweet said. But it basically said they were getting rid of the subscription feed on YouTube. And this is really going to negatively impact small content creators. And my definition of small content creator is anyone with under a thousand subscribers. I myself am a small YouTuber. I do appreciate the views, the likes, the comments, all that, all you guys give me. But just realistically speaking here, from my point of view, if YouTube were to implement their experiment, I don't, I'm just going to call it experiment. I'm not going to call it what they're calling it. But it'll hurt people like me because... For one, my biggest complaint with YouTube is, and I'm pretty sure there are tons of people who have this problem as well. There, when you when you hit that bell, or do you subscribe to somebody? It's supposed to send notifications out for uploads and streams. You know, for when they go live and they're streaming, but not all the time. People do not get notifications from stuff from people they're subscribed to, fellow content creators. And that, that's one of my biggest complaints, concerns about YouTube. They really need to fix their notification system. What I'm getting at is this. They, they don't need to mess with the subscription feed because say you miss out, you miss out on a notification from someone you're subscribed to and you go to look on your subscription feed and you don't see that the video's there because it's they've done away with the subscription feed. Thankfully, I've updated YouTube on all the devices I have and I still, thank God, have my subscription feed. The subscription feed is really useful to have because it allows you to... So you missed an upload from someone you subscribed to. You can go through it. You can do it videos only. Videos and post are videos only. You can do it A to Z. You can find that person in your list you're sub to. Click on them. Takes you to their channel. And you're able to watch their content and miss out on any uploads you might have missed because you didn't get the notification. Or you're like me. You get so many notifications that sometimes... You miss out on uploads but yeah that's that's my biggest complaint against youtube today it's probably not gonna change i myself am a small content creator 
I'm looking at this in a doomsday negative way. I'm lucky to get five views on one upload. Streams, I do a whole lot, uh, streams for me are a whole lot better. I'm gonna try and stream more in the future. I just gotta find the stuff to stream. But if all this keeps going, my channel might eventually die. And same with any other small content creators for, sorry about that. My, you can't see my head face for a second, but any other small content creators under a thousand subscribers. And eventually, especially if they're monetized, you know, the, I'm, the way YouTube does monetization is stupid, is dumb. Like back in the day, it used to be thousand subscribers. You, you can 10,000 total, that's a thousand subscribers so many hour view time and back in the day it used to be you get 10,000 subscribers you can apply for a partnership with them and get ad revenue on your videos now since the whole Jake Paul crap I don't like Jake Paul by the way I watched literally one of his videos I was like who watches this junk this garbage but yeah it, he's to blame for YouTube change it because i've been on many channels that have over a thousand subscribers and they should have super chat enabled but they don't and it's all thanks to look to jake paul or logan paul i don't remember which one it was they're i'm not gonna get on the paul brothers i'm about to end this video guys thank you for watching thank you for listening to my ramblings and my concerns about youtube and how they're screwing around with small content creators. This is Mitch signing off. As always, remember to like, comment, subscribe for more content. See you guys in the next one. Peace.